Uh, well, forget Red Bull. Coming up, the gum that can make you more alert and boost your memory. We'll show you how it works. Uh, would you like to feel more alert and boost your memory? That is what I try for every day. <laughs> a Stanford grad student says he invented the solution. NBC Bay Area's medical reporter, Marianne Favreau, has something to chew on. How about a little think gum? Think all gum is created equal? Think again, because now there's think gum. Daniel Rosenblatt has been an avid gum chewer since middle school, and he says this gum is different. It helps me focus. Um, chewing gums always help me focus. And I think maybe the added ingredient of caffeine um, is a little bit better than some of the other some of the other gums that I've had. Stanford grad student Matt Davidson came up with the idea. What I would do is actually buy peppermint gum and put rosemary in my gum and just chew it during exams and I did pretty well. Um, and so after I graduated, I thought that this would be a great product for other students to help them with school. Think gum is sugar-free and has a little caffeine. Davidson researched the other ingredients, including guarana and ginkgo biloba. Ginkgo biloba can um, speed short-term working memory. But San Jose State nutrition professor Dr. Marjorie Friedman considers the memory boost claim a sticking point. One of the issues is getting the active ingredients in this gum into your bloodstream, ultimately to your brain where it's going to have any effect. Davidson insists the ingredients in Think Gum can provide memory benefits and he's planning clinical trials to prove it. Think Gum is a hot seller on the Stanford campus, especially during midterms and finals, but now the sales have gone international and Matt has had so many requests, he's had to place another order for a million more packets. Daniel says he chews the gum five times a day and is convinced it helped him do better on a grad school entrance exam. He says Think Gum offers a competitive edge worth sinking your teeth into. Marianne Favreau, NBC Bay Area News. All right. Opened it. Handing one to this one. Yeah. Handing one to this one. Chew it. We'll check with you in a second. Research <laughs> indicates that if you are exposed to peppermint while you're studying, look, <laughs> they're getting smarter. Oh. <laughs> and then you're exposed to the same smell during an exam. It can trigger some memories from that study session. And students think that they like the think gum because they're not allowed to bring sodas or coffee into the exam, but they are allowed to chew. So, there's oh. noting that no matter how much you chew, you still have to study to learn oh. more about oh. think gum. <laughs> this is for the birds. Wow. Now, how is it? It's refreshing. It's minty. Yeah. It's minty. And rosemary-ish, too, huh? The area of a circle is uh, pi times radius squared. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! And wow. pi is pies are circles. <laughs> That's it kind of worked. All right. NBC11.com. Well, it's still now. <laughs> <laughs> Click on health if you want more. This has ginkgo biloba in it. Uh -huh. Ginkgo is also my family crest. Uh, it's a predominant... Uh, well, my family crest is three ginkgo leaves. So really? There you go. Yeah. So, tied into there with the Enoa family. Good yeah. stuff. Let's see how it works on the memory, though.